Hi guys, it's Nicole and welcome back to my channel. Good morning everyone, welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be filming a productive day in my life as a college freshman here at San Diego State. I've been getting some requests from you guys to show how I stay productive as a college student. So I thought I would walk you through a whole day and show you exactly that. This is what I gotta say to-do list. I know, I know, I talk about them all the time in like every single video, but it's a system that I found works for me, so I'm sticking to it. I'm gonna keep preaching about it. Don't knock it till you try it. But no, today I'm actually gonna like show you guys and walk you through how I incorporate to-do list in my life and how much it helps me. I always set my to-do list the night before the next day, so right in the morning I can just start checking things off. I have my laptop here with me and I'm just gonna show you guys today's to-do list. I use this website called Notion, not sponsored. I genuinely love this website so much and and I've been using it for so long now, but I basically got a template off the marketplace and then just like customize it to make it my own, but it's my life planner. And then here's my to-do list section. I also have like my weekly calendars and weekly agenda. Okay, so my to-do list, this is literally how I stay sane and get through my days. And it may look like a lot. And that is because I literally write down every single task that I need to get done throughout my day, even if it seems like little. So this could be like what time I need to wake up, my morning habits, getting ready for the day, all the tasks throughout my day, and then say my like nighttime so like getting ready for the night and my nighttime habits and i know it may seem a little intense but again it's a system that works for me and this is how i stay productive but basically today a little rundown i have a morning workout three classes a few meetings and then just like a bunch of computer work during the day i'm filming this at like the beginning of the week and that's usually kind of when i'm the busiest or like there's a lot on my plate you know so i really like to start off the week getting a lot of stuff done being pretty productive and checking off all of my tasks all right we already have the first task done of the day which is wake up i woke up at 6 45 this morning so we can check that off the to-do list i'm gonna click it boom yay first task done <laughs> but with that being said it's officially time to start our day so i hope you guys enjoy if you're watching this and need some motivation to be productive i hope your productive day goes well we can have an amazing productive day together let's go next set of tasks to complete on my to-do list are all of my morning habits morning habits are complete check that off now it is time to get ready for the day Already. I decided to like low-key try today. Did my natural makeup, curled my hair. I've been curling my hair like so frequently lately. One, I have to for like game days and dance team events. But then also like on the daily, I kind of like the girls. And then outfit of the day. I'm wearing this sweat set from Gymshark. I'm also wearing a workout set under, but this is from their Lifting Essentials collection. And it's so cute. You guys, look how gloomy it is outside. It's so gloomy. So I'm like... I'm settling for a workout set, but this is so comfy. I think it's gonna get hotter towards the middle of the day, so maybe I'll change later. But since we're starting the day off with like a morning workout, I thought this outfit was fine. I need to leave in like five minutes, but last thing I'm going to do is start posting on my socials. I'll usually start in the morning and then just like post throughout the day. I need to start posting on Snapchat and then I need to post something for a brand on TikTok. So I'm gonna do that right now. All 
before I post our live. If you guys don't already, follow me on my other socials, at Nicole Leno. I post on basically everything else, Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok, and I post pretty frequently too. If you guys want to keep updated on other stuff, you can check out those. All right, you guys, it is time to head out the door. But first, I wanted to show you a little update on the to-do list. Boom, baby, look at that, all of these tasks checked literally like looking at my to-do list just like makes me happy because i already feel so accomplished within like the first hour of waking up not only does it feel like rewarding to like check tasks off but i feel like it also gives me like motivation to like keep going and continue checking things off for the rest of the day and that's exactly what we're gonna do so let's get on with the rest of our day Made it to the arc. This is SCC's gym. So nice, you guys. I'll never get over it. Today, I wanted to hit some upper body. Usually, I do cardio on these mornings, but I don't know. I'm feeling like lifting. So I'm gonna go over to the dumbbells right now. And hopefully, we have a good workout. Let's go. Workout is complete. We can check morning lift off. I also just picked up an acai bowl, my usual order from Shakespeare. I get build your bowl with bananas, coconut flakes, granola, and peanut butter, so bus. But I had a great workout. I actually haven't done my upper body lift in a while because whenever we lift throughout the week, we do like team workouts. So we either do it like with a buddy or like in a group and we have like specified ones. I did like my workout routine that I used to do like back at my home gym. It was a little nostalgic. Okay, anyways, look how weird this weather is. You guys, it is so gloomy and sad. I actually ended up packing this shirt in my bag though because I checked the weather app and guess what? It's gonna be 80 degrees in like an hour. It's so odd. When I was walking to the gym though, I literally felt sprinkles and then it's gonna be like so hot later. I see weather has been confusing lately. But I'm on my way to class now, number one out of three. All my other days of the week, I only have one or two. Today's my longest day, but it still really isn't that bad. All my classes should be really chill too. I just have two lectures and then one discussion class. My first one starts in like 30 minutes, so I have a little bit to just like walk there and eat my bowl. I'm gonna call my mom. I usually call her right when I wake up, but I had to listen to some videos this morning. So I haven't had the chance to talk to her yet, but I wanna like recap her on the weekend and give her a little deeper as always. I'm gonna eat my bowl, call my mom, and then off to my first class of the day. We're back. We're back again. Okay, we actually finished our comm speech like really early. Oh, she did her oh. speech today. Oh oh I was so nervous. So good. No, she did great. We just been talking. Give her a little debrief. Well, we, we did a little catch up. Oh, and look at our view. It's so it's pretty. It's so pretty. Yeah. So this is a productive day in my life. So I'm okay. gonna ask all my friends, what do you do to stay productive in college? Like as a new freshman, you know, mm. adjusting to this life. Yes. <laughs> During my like little breaks, because I have hour yeah. breaks in between my class, I go just like get a snack. Yeah. That's what I'm doing right now. She gets her lemon loaf. Yes. I and I just like do work and I'm super productive during those yes. times because I can't get work in the dorm. Like yeah. I can't okay. get work done in the dorm. No, that's so valid. Okay, I love it. Yes. Uh, we love you, Audrey. Yes. Okay, period. So we're gonna stay here for a little longer. Yes, some class. more um, debrief. Yeah, and then I go to class. Okay, bye. 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 Me and Ethan just finished our Asian studies hey, class. Guys. Okay, period. Sorry. Wow, he's so popular. I told him, I was like, I'm gonna ask you a question for the vlog, and now he's overthinking it. Don't overthink it. Okay. How do you, as a college freshman at SUSU, stay productive? I be social. Hey, oh, you know, wait, that's also a good answer. Going to party, balancing my social and academic life. That's so good. I was actually gonna talk about that later because I was gonna like take a nap and just feel like you have to balance like different things in college, but like that's a really good point because you can't like work 100% of the time. But I will say, Ethan's nose are fire, guys. The first time I saw you in Asian studies class, I was like, oh my god. Uh, he's locked in. I know. <laughs> he's like, I know. <laughs> okay, great answer. See, it was easy. I know. Damn, you guys. This ain't even funny. Woof! It is so warm. I am sweating. Anyways, though, no. I'm back in my dorm. Next thing on my to-do list is to eat lunch. And yes, I literally put these as my tasks, like eat breakfast, eat lunch, eat dinner. Because you would think you would remember to eat in college, but sometimes I forget. My eating schedule is a little wonky at the time, so I've been putting it on my to-do list lately and it's been helping. Anyways, I have some leftovers from last night. Me and Ava went to Epic Wings yesterday and it was so good. But I have like two chicken tenders left. I'm also gonna freaking cool down because it's so hot. I've been getting garlic parm at both Epic Wings and Wingstop lately. Fire flavor, in my opinion. Okay, I'm gonna pop this in the microwave. Also, that's my chair. I don't know why it's so noisy. While I wait for my food, I'm gonna change into a different outfit. I just put some jean shorts on. And my tender is already. Cheers. Mm -mm -mm. Eat lunch, check. 
Okay, I've cooled down. My tummy is happy. And now I have an interview over Zoom. It's not gonna be like filmed or anything. I'm just gonna have like a conversation. And then I think it's gonna be put into like an article or something. But it's just like a 15 minute call. We're gonna talk about my experience so far as a new college student here at State. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm gonna hop on right now. Hi, yes. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Gosh, thank you for meeting me today, obviously. Yeah, so of course. Like no, sorry the scheduling has been so weird. I'm trying to find pockets of time to meet. Glad no, 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 time. you're all set. You're, oh, no. Good. Okay, first of all, how's everything going for you? Oh my gosh, oh my so gosh. far so good. I feel like this first month I've just been really trying to adjust and like find my place yeah. here. And I think it's going well. Okay, yay, interview is done. To share a little bit more info on that interview, it was actually with another student here at State and she's writing personal stories about people and she chose me for one of them. So that's why I was talking to her about like my new experience at SCSU and just like how it's been going so far. It was really cute. It was really great. I, I think she's sending me the rough draft this week too. So I all get to like be in the loop with that. So that's cool. We've had such a productive morning so far. Let's do a little to-do list check. Slay, look at that. The next task on my to-do list. Ah, so excited. The task I was looking forward to, guess what it is? It's take a nap. <laughs> and this is what I wanted to talk about earlier. Personally, I think rest can also be so, so productive. Obviously, if you're like sleeping at like four in the morning and then waking up at like 3 p.m. the next day, maybe that's not the most productive thing, but I will say naps are great, especially in college. I love my naps. Personally, I think I work very well if I wake up early in the morning. Like today, I went to the gym, I got classes done, did some computer work, and then in like the middle of the day when I'm kind of like crashing, so like lay in bed and take a nap real quick. And then when I wake up, get on with the rest of it. But yeah, you guys know me. I nap like every day. I will say sometimes my naps can be very lengthy But again, I like try to have them as productive as possible so that I could have rest like for other stuff I like to say this you can't be your 100 when you're at 50. So on that note, I'm gonna take a nap <laughs> I only have like less than an hour though before I have my next class. So it'll be like a quick power nap I'm gonna hop in bed. I'll see you guys in a little bit Psych, I'm still awake. Guys, look who I'm on call with. Hey, y'all. It's Christian, yay. yay. I ended up calling him for something and then we just ended up talking for the last 20 minutes. Miss you, bro. Yay. Miss <laughs> you too. Okay, he's about to leave though. Love you, I'll talk to you later. Love you too, call me anytime, sis. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Fire. I have been laying down though and it's been really nice. It might be a little too late to take a nap. Maybe I'll just take one after class. You guys, a murder has just been made. Ah, getting my keys out of my bag so I could unlock my door. I ripped my squishy off my keychain. I'm so sad. Look at the remnants on my on my keychain. Well, rest in peace to my little squishy on my keychain. Maybe I'll like put it on my nightstand or something. Anyways, as you can see, I am back in my dorm. Classes are done for the day. Check, check, check. Three and done. I actually ended up going to Rubio's with Audrey. I got a burrito for my second lunch because the tenders weren't cutting it. I was like still hungry. So now, I think it is perfect time for a nap. That is like the perfect combo. Some yummy food. It'll put me straight to bed. I do have to be up in like less than an hour again. And I'll tell you guys why in a second. I'm gonna try to take my nap. Attempt number two. Let's see how this goes. Success. I slept for like 30 minutes. Hi guys. Well, I'm back on campus. Look at the student union. It's like popping right now. I guess there's like an event going on or something, but maybe I'll check it out after. But now we only have a few more things on our agenda for the evening. I'm currently heading to Vietnamese club meeting. This club meets every other week because Filipino club, they meet every single week. So I haven't seen the people in this one for a little bit. So I'm really excited. It's a general board meeting. So we just talk about like all the info that's going on and like the upcoming events. See you guys in there. We're getting dinner. We're walking to UTK right now, but I wanted to ask Ava. Okay, so this is a productive day in my life. So how do you stay productive as a college student? <laughs> um, as a college student, I yeah. stay productive by doing homework in between my classes. Yeah. I like will eat or like I'll get shake smart. Yeah. Usually it's shake smart. I've been living off shake smart and I just sit down like and she locks it. And I lock in. She locks the heck all in. All my work done. We love to hear Preferably by Thursday. Mm -hmm. Thursday is my yes. deadline. So I have Friday, Saturday, Sunday. To yeah. Do yeah, me too. Cause I don't have classes on Friday. So then it's just like. Me neither. <laughs> it's chill time. Perfect answer. I knew you'd kill Yay! it. <laughs> okay, we're getting food now. Bye. I got. Wait, look at us being healthy. <laughs> I got an Asian chicken salad and I got a caprese salad. Yummy! Yeah. So yummy! Excuse 
me. Hello, Student Union. You guys, it's so pretty. Well, we're back on campus, as you can see. The amount of times I've walked like this pathway, I think I've been through this pathway like a hundred times today. Every day. Every day, single. yeah, every single day. This is gonna be the last thing I do before just like being in my dorm for the rest of the night. We have a little dance team meeting. Well, it's actually not that little because it's two hours. It's, it's a big, fat dance team meeting. I'm pretty sure it's with all of, like the sports clubs and like the faculty, so it's just gonna be very informational. So we just have to sit there and listen. We're meeting up at one of the buildings with the whole team and we're gonna listen in. Yes. And we're back in the dorm once again. <laughs> Guys, I'm so tired, oh my God. The meeting went well though. It was just talking about like code of conduct stuff. Some like deeper topics that we have to follow. Just being a sports club on campus that is done with. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I've been sitting in this chair watching TikTok for the last like 15 minutes. I like feel my eyes like closing and I wanna hop in my bed so bad and just go to bed. But we're finishing off the night strong and getting the rest of our to-do list done. So I put my phone down. I'm not gonna watch TikTok anymore. Even though it's really tempting. And let's do a to-do list update. Look at her go. Okay. We are home stretch. We only got this much. I want to try to sleep in like an hour at 10 because I have to be up really early tomorrow and honestly I didn't get good sleep last night and I'll talk about sleep later in this video when I'm in bed. But anyways, the last few things that we need to do is get ready for the night and do my nighttime habits. So finally, after this long busy day, let's get ready for bed. In the same exact position as this morning, but now all of my tasks are complete. My last task is to sleep by 10 p.m. and it's currently 9.46. So we are right on schedule, so I can check that off too. Oh, and I also wanted to talk about sleep schedule. I already talked about naps earlier in this video, but sleep schedule matters so, so much when you're trying to be productive. Not gonna lie, my sleep schedule has been kind of whack in college. If you know, you know, I used to go to bed, I'm literally a freaking grandma. I used to go to bed at like 9 p.m. so I could wake up at 5 a.m. the next day. That was my schedule like during my senior year because I wanted to like work out before class and go to the gym like super super early but obviously throughout my weeks in college my nights look very oh my ice machine is going. Oh my god, side note. Okay, I promise I'm gonna stop yapping soon. I saw a comment where it was like the ice machine is like the new planes because back at home there would always be so many planes when I filmed and now like my ice machine always goes off. Okay, I just thought that was funny. Okay, what was I saying? Right, sleeping. My nights look very different in college. Like some nights I don't finish practice until like 11 p.m. So then I don't even get back to my dorm and like get to shower and get ready for the bed until like midnight or one. On the weekends, you know, I try not to be a grandma and go out and have fun with my friends because <laughs> you should also be trying to have a balance you know I'm definitely not sleeping at like 9 p.m. every single night there are some days where I try to and that's usually when I'm getting up early the next day but I'm adjusting to it I will say though when I feel my best and when I feel the most productive is when I have a good sleep schedule and a good to-do list so if you're ever needing some advice on like where to start like if you ever want to be productive get good sleep and make a to-do list you have no idea the feeling of like a completed to-do list <laughs> that brings me so much joy yay but on that note thank you guys so much for spending the day with me and completing my to-do list with me. This is just an example of how I'm trying to stay productive as a new college student here at State. Obviously, every single day is different. Honestly, today was like a pretty busy day. Like, I feel like I had something basically every single hour, but sometimes it's not as much as this. It's like maybe one class, I take a nap, and then I have dance practice. So it definitely differs, but when I do have like a lot on my plate and a really busy schedule, I definitely like to do my intense like to-do list planning so that I make sure I don't forget anything and I'm staying on top of all of my stuff so if you guys have any productivity tips if you're in school work any of that comment them down below and we can all be learning and be our best productive selves together i'm actually gonna make my to-do list for tomorrow now and that's the last thing i'm gonna do before i head to bed yeah i hope you guys enjoyed being productive with me hopefully if you needed some motivation to be productive and finish up the things that you have to hopefully this video gave you that and if not i just hope you enjoyed watching it but if you guys stayed till the end of this video comment down below the check emoji because we checked off so
so many things off today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like or comment down below, subscribe to my channel, subscribe to the family channel, and turn on all the post notifications. I will see you guys back with more Coley and College content. I love you guys so, so much. Stay positive. Bye.